Can you imagine? It turns out that modern people still struggle with the same financial issues as people 6,000 years ago. Watch this video till the end because we'll share timeless advice on finances for free in under 10 minutes. Hi and welcome to Money Generator. We regularly upload value-packed free content for you to enhance your journey to financial freedom, so don't miss out. In this video, we will share 5 golden rules of money, provided with easy to follow steps for beginners to help you implement them in your real life. Before we begin, this video is based on The Richest Man in Babylon by George Clayson. Although we will cover most of the key points, we highly recommend you to read the whole book because it is the vital game changer and transformed the lives of most of the wealthy successful people you know nowadays. The main point, make money, spend less than you earn, save up the rest of your earnings to invest, and make it grow your wealth. You cannot out-earn your stupidity. Again, make money, save up, invest, repeat. Make money, save up, invest, repeat. So simple but yet not so easy. Let's get into it. The rule number one, gold favors those who save at least 10% of their income. You must spend less than you earn to be able to do something with that money. You will never be able to get ahead if you don't have additional cash. You'll be living paycheck to paycheck and will almost certainly wind up a lot of debt. This is a terrific scenario. Paying yourself first means ignoring all the debt and obligations. You're what you save for yourself and not what you earn and spend. Despite the simplicity of the rule, many athletes who make unbelievably huge amounts of money each year still fail to set aside 10% of their income for the future. Rather than having full financial security for when their bodies can no longer function, athletes typically declare bankruptcy soon after their contracts expire. So what can you do to avoid this fate? While Clayson suggests saving 10% of your income, we suggest saving at least 20. Yes. 10% is a nice starting point, especially for people who may have never saved before, but 20% is indeed a ratio that will give you financial independence so much faster. 10 out of this 20 will go to investing, but the other 10 will first pay off all the debt you might be in right now. Next, build up an untouchable reserve of money covering at least 6 months of living expenses. Once you feel like it's enough, Make the stream fill a pool of emergencies. And then you can give it a mission of funding your dreams, vacations, cars, luxury items, etc. Rule number two, gold likes to multiply only for investors. Now that you have mastered how to save aside a portion of your income, what's next? Hopefully, you'll be able to put it into good use and earn extra money. Investing means spending money to make more money. However, you probably know how most people use their hard-earned savings. They let their money sit in the extra bank account that earns them 0.1% interest. In the best case, they put it in the bank savings account with a profit from 2 to 6% at most. It's easy to guess what happens throughout the years, isn't it? Their savings decrease in value instead of increasing because the inflation exceeds their 2 to 6% interest rate. What can you do differently? Invest in your knowledge first, in your financial literacy to become a real investor and find your niche. Nowadays we have tons of amazing opportunities. Real estate, stocks market, cryptocurrencies. And don't be afraid of investing because nothing is riskier than not having financial literacy. Working in a 9 to 5 job with a miserable fixed paycheck which decreases in value almost every month and putting savings in a bank or pension funds. You can definitely afford to fail a few times now as a beginner at investing rather than facing the reality we mentioned above when you're already too old. Number 3. Gold remains in the hands of those who committed to wise people. Choose your financial advisors carefully and make sure you trust those you are letting to handle your money. Whether it's a tenant at your rental facility, a personal accountant, or real estate or broker agency, you need to be sure that they will not only do their best they can, but do the right thing. Most celebrities and athletes are naive to entrust their whole fortune to financial experts. They most likely are not fancy of dealing with the Excel sheets and budgeting, and believe it's better off 
in the hands of a professional. Perhaps it's true. However, for example, Kenneth Starr, a celebrity financial consultant, was accused of stealing over 30 million from Uma Thurman and Sylvester Stallone. When it comes to solid amounts, it's hard to trust even relatives and yourself too. So be careful. Probably the best way is to put your wealth into your own hands only. You must have faith in your ability to learn from whatever mistakes you make and avoid making them next time. Number 4. Gold is lost if it's invested in something you're unfamiliar with. This one sounds pretty obvious. There are always real investors versus dilettantes, speculators and gamblers. Although you have to avoid paralysis by analysis, but surely a proper research about the type of investment is a must. Let's take the stock market as an example. You can't just buy a share of a company just because you've heard it looks promising or you like the product. Also, any investment is a long-term strategy and not an overnight wealth. Too many people see the hypes and downfalls as gambling, which cost them losing a fortune. Instead, we suggest learning from successful investors who have their advice to show in practice on their personal experience. Also, there are tons of great free resources on the internet, podcasts, blogs, even Instagram, and of course YouTube including our channel. Make sure to check out as many trustful sources as possible and make choices yourself. And number 5. Gold and get rich quick schemes don't mix. Certain people promise investment returns that are simply too wonderful to be true. When you're being offered once-in-a-lifetime investment opportunity, ask yourself, why me? What makes you the chosen one? It's likely they think you're the easy one to fool. Ponzi scheme arrangement works for a while, but when this system blows up, most of the people who invested with them collapse. Wealth that comes swiftly goes the same way. Because its purpose of its existence, wealth that comes to give happiness and satisfaction to its owner comes gradually. Unfortunately, there are countless examples of folks who have no idea what they're doing with their hard-earned and sometimes not that hard-earned money, and it's vanished in a blink of an eye. We have a bonus summary for you with 7 cures of lean purse, which also sums up the rules of the gold we mentioned. First cure. Start saving. Anyone who earns anything can do it. Control your spending. What we call must-haves always increases with the income. Third, make it multiply. You must be the master and money is your slave. Four, guard your treasures from loss. Be careful who you trust. Five, buy a house instead of renting. Pay mortgage instead to own it eventually. Six, ensure your future income. Become responsible for your retirement. 7. Increase your ability to earn. Increase your savings proportionally. We hope you enjoyed this video and squeezed the maximum value out of it. We have a free online course for you. If you're willing to learn how to earn 5,000 per day online, just asking people some yes or no questions, check the link in the description. Check out our previous video about saving up before investing if you haven't seen it yet. See you in the next video.